Okay, streamy time. Stream, stream, stream. Streaming, streaming, streaming. Streaming? But also streaming. And have you heard of streaming? But also streaming, though. And also streaming. But on the other hand, streaming. Let's put you over there. Thank you, very please. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Every stream starts with telling the world that I'm streaming. And by the world, I mean a few Discord channels and Twitter. Alrighty. You go away, you go away. Hey, Marcel! Hello, hello. Okay, I think everything is in order. So I guess we should uh, begin. Alright. So, for uh, anybody watching this later, this is the Wood Canoe Conquest stream. I have no idea how many of these uh, we're going to do. Oh, hello, Belquent. And, uh, yeah, I'm just going to roll through Neater on an easier difficulty, because, frankly, I got nothing to prove. Also, I can't prove it, whatever it is. And we're just going to see how far we get using uh, mostly wooden canoes, because I love making wooden canoes. I just, I just kind of do. So, we got to go start a new campaign, I guess. So, quest for Neater, launch quest for Neater, and easy, medium, hard, very hard. We're going to start on easy, use custom settings, and I do want to, well, basically keep the combat less challenging. Okay. We do want to up the growth factor, though, because I want to see lots and lots of ships coming my way, just swarms of stuff. Swarms of stuff to come and get me. Hopefully, I have not forgotten uh, anything. Do do do. Huh. I'm reading the stuff here. That's interesting. The stuff. The stuff. The stuff. Alrighty. So let's well let's go. Let's go. Hopefully, I don't have to show off the screen too much. Hello, Wony. Welcome to the stream. Let's go. Let's do things. Ah! I was upside down. Alright, first things first. Pull all. And darn it, I should have made a canoe attack satellite, and I didn't. Uh, retrofit. I'm going to retrofit you to my favorite thing. Fortresses. Resource versus circle house. Retrofit to that. Easy peasy. And... Starting rib, scrap you, because you're no good. And just so everyone knows what this thing looks like, it looks adorable. Hello, Minix. Hello, Pazivist. Hello, hello. And I'm going to load in a vehicle. Spy satellite. Spider copter. Pull all. My microphone is actually blocking an important part of the UI. I need to move. Ah, no! There's already drama on the stream. There's already drama on the stream. Lifting. Yep, you are repairing. Are you doing stuff? Yes, you are. Okay. Alright, spider copter. Moving out. You go over there. Reveal unto us the map. And are you harvesting stuff? Yes, you are. Good boy. Yeah, I know, Belquint. Uh, the spider copter uh, looks like this. It only is canoe shaped if you really use your imagination. But it is, um... Why did I call this thing the spider copter again? It doesn't look like a spider. Therefore, well, I'm lying twice. Okay, so what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We have materials, and we're gonna make some very, very cheap canoes. 
Do not worry, the canoes begin very soon. Alright, canoe copter. Yeah, we've got this guy. And we can afford a bunch of stuff. Uh, wow, it is actually really nice to have cheap vehicles for once. Also, these things do not have very creative names, uh, because they just don't. <laughs> uh, wait, uh, eight propellers. Eight propellers? Moving out. Maybe? Wait. Actually, yeah, that fits. Uh, the eight uh, Deddy Blades on this. That fits. That fits. Thank you, Belquint. You have said, ooh, thank you, MS uh, X Bestia. Super cool of you for the follow. Okay, what are we doing? What are we doing in our lives? Okay. Also, if people do uh, cool stuff like um, subscriptions and follows and donate bits and I don't see it, I apologize. Uh, because I am a horribly unobservant person and I cannot multitask uh, for peanuts. Alrighty, ho then. Let me see here. How are you doing? How are you doing? Do, 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 do. This is the fun part of the campaign where it's, uh, it's quite slow and the Deep Water Guard is being nice and complacent. The Onyx Watch doing stuff. Receiving. What a gun now. Okay, we need to keep you full of material. Receiving. Good cider, we also need to keep you full of material. Receiving. Also need to put you into a fleet and assign proper resource groups, which I always forget to do Receiving. Receiving. in the designer. Yay, pirate music. Receiving. Gosh dang it. Receive, moving now. Receive, moving now. Receive. Uh, hello. Receive, receive, receive. There we go. Let's merge you into a fleet. Receive. And fleet name is... Goody goodness one. There we go. Hello, Zundluners. Hello, Dustboot. Oh, glad to hear it. Glad to hear you're loving the game. It's a good game. Alright, let us make sure these guys are full up. Let's capture some more territory over here. Ukrainian and built out. Well, I'm I'm doing pretty good. I cannot complain. Hello, Wicker 13. Hmm. We got people. We got lots of people, it's good. Receiving. I wonder if I'll be able to spawn in another resource harvester because we got one. Listening. Is anyone is wondering what these things are like? Uh, this is the wood gunner. No, stop moving. It's just very simple. It's a wee canoe uh, with uh, simple miniguns on it. Nothing really to write home about, but it is damn cheap. And wah, the wood cider I kind of like because, well, it's an asymmetric broadsider. So it's just got this <laughs> one actually quite strong cram cannon sticking out the right side. It's got, because it just does a right broadside anyway, it's got azipods. Little hydrofoils in front, little AA guns, and it's very simple, very cute, and I love it. Good evening, uh, Rule Stolbogen. Cola? Ooh, yeah, lots of people. And Cola. And Belkunt. Yep, mono broadsider. Okay, where's my UI? Okay, it needs to go back here. Oh, yeah, what was I doing? I was spawning in a harvest canoe copter, because those are fun. No material, but keep full of energy. And you are a creator, thank you.
Listening. Do, do, do. And away we go. Listening. Moving out. Are you harvesting? Yeah, you're harvesting. Receiving. Okay. How are we doing? We don't have a hell of a lot of material. So let's speed up time a little bit so we can get more material. Receiving. Okay, everyone's declared war on each other. Receiving. Okay, now you now. can do that. Jolly good. Now. Except now I gotta. Go over here, and you, sir, need to go do that. So you have the nice wiggle room. Why does the resource thing keep being activated? Probably because I keep clicking on it. What the hell are you doing? You are not supposed to do that. Okay, you're going at max speed now, and that's very nice. Whoa, well, actually, should save you. No, not you. Not you. Not you. There we go. Save a wood gunner, so when we spawn more of you idiots in... Receiving. There we go. Now we will save the campaign, because we can do that. Hello, Maxim Andre. Uh, we can probably... Uh, do, do, do. Interesting. Okay, what can we do? Wood... Canoe Conquest 1. There we go. Save completed successfully. Congratulations, you have saved the game. Listening. Now we're going to preemptively go and declare war on the Deepwater Guard, and hopefully they're not going to immediately send flying squirrels at us because RNG RNG is a problem. Moving out, moving out. Moving you can out. go over there and capture stuff. Receiving. And they're gonna hate us because we're being very naughty. We are trespassing. Moving yep. Out. They don't like us anymore. Listen. Who would have thunk? There's a usual strategy I like to do, which is I send um, ships up north, and I send aircraft down the middle, uh, simply because wood, uh, ships don't play well in that narrow channel. Hello, driver! Yeah, I hope people aren't too inconvenienced uh, by the ads, because that would be terrible. Oh, yes. Pirates of the Caribbean music. I love these little harvest canoe copters simply because they're so cheap. They are so cheap and nasty. Okay. We are progressing well. We are progressing well. You get to go over there. You get to Listening. do stuff. Listening. Really should uh, move my uh, spider copter over here just to see things more effectively. Also, sticking a jet engine on the spider copter was one of the best things I've ever done. Simply because the thing couldn't move before. Listening. Actually, I'm just gonna quickly go over here. And produce a backup thing. Listening. Because while we're uh, while we're doing stuff, we need a trump card, and uh, the canoe copter is it. Uh, yeah, fleet name. Sky canoes one. There we go. I'm just fully embracing the canoe stereotype that I have accidentally created for myself. Hey there, Dr. Trifonius. Hello, Minix. Is it a canoe or a canoe stream? I know not. 
I think it's like, I think it's both. The difference between canoe and canoe is, um, is a difficult one to establish. Also, it is very nice to be on an easier difficulty. It was very, very nice indeed. Yay, war! Well, look at you, etc., 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 etc. People are coming to get me, and that's okay. Listening. Hang on a minute. Why is... Full. There we go. And what's happening over here? Oh, nope, nope, nope. Okay. I am going to save the game again. Wood Canoe Conquest 2. I know how to spell. I know how to spell. Uh, canoes are canoes used by the Iron Guard. Campaign. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, where were we? Uh, we were over here. Receiving, moving now. And while we're here, we're just gonna pick a fight with the walrus too. Because the walrus doesn't actually have any material, which means it can't find a fire at us. Wood cider, you go there. Wood gunner, you go over here. And this is probably gonna be quite a short fight, because I say so. I don't remember if I stuck repair bots on the wood cider, so... Oh, whoops. I wonder what this cram shell is going to do. <laughs> it's gonna take out the Sinus Outpost in one shot. That's what it's going to do. Deacon's Christmas, that was easy. Uh, did I mention that this uh, thing is, um... It's an HEEMP cram. And it really is very strong for uh, the cost of this thing. And there's the walrus, and by the looks of it, it can't move. And the wood gunner is doing what wood gunners do best, and just chucking so many bullets around. Brrr. Man, I love my walker news. What's chat saying? Chat saying stuff. Yep. Okay. Noob gets flagged, you say. What does that mean? Oh, right. Noob gets flagged for some reason. Okay, that's weird. That's weird. Alrighty, ho then. Alright, I'm going to send these guys over here because I can do that. I'm going to need faster... Um, what do you call it? I'm going to need much faster harvesters, aren't I? And this guy's not building, uh, building very, very quickly, is he? Interesting. How much material is in that resource zone? Okay. Listening. You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to... Because goodness knows, commodities were not helping me. Alrighty, ho then. What were we doing? We were... Are we ready to pick a fight with that Atlas? Are we ready? Receiving. I think we're ready. Let's capture here. Because we can do that. Uh, what are you saying? Uh, which canoe is a shark canoe? Yep. 
<laughs> so base doesn't have many tentacles. But, uh, yeah, I retrofitted my uh, starting base uh, into one of my own uh, platforms, so... Yeah, I'm just going to wait for the canoe copter to finish its, uh, its jolly business. And let's speed up time a bit, because I forgot to do that. All was quiet up north. Oh, the wood gunner. Um, I wasn't thinking shark uh, when I did it. I just kind of put a tail on it, because I like to do that. Okay, then. Now the fun bit. Alright, you can now go over there. Canoe copter. Oh, I should show you the canoe copter. I like this thing because it's a helicopter. And, um, fun fact, um, it's got a really terrible laser on it, uh, expressly for the purpose of shooting down small aircraft. Uh, it can, it takes a lo long time to, um, uh, shoot down a flying squirrel, but it also has large missiles, so, and it only costs 35,000 materials. Also, the whole tail of this thing, uh, is full of ammunition, so, and spaced out ammunition too, so, yeah, this is a weirdly good looking thing. Oh yeah, and also first front sider I've ever made that uses custom jets to move forwards and backwards. It's not incredibly fast, but yeah. This is about as meta as wooden canoes can get, because it's not really a canoe, it's a helicopter. I really do like how this thing looks. It's not a practical design, and yes, that is alloy on the end there, because otherwise it would be too back-heavy. Thank you, driver. I try. I do like helicopters. I need to build more helicopters, because helicopters are fantastic. Helicopters make me happy. Helicopters are the bee's knees, the llama's pajamas, uh, and the relevant elephant. And I'm gonna save uh, the campaign right here. Jolly good, jolly good. Honestly, I should swap these two around. So we're gonna go... Gonna... Oh yeah, location defended. I can't actually capture it. That was very silly of me. Let's go over here. You go over here. Uh, KA-52, that's, um, what is it? That's a Russian attack helicopter, yeah? The shark? Yep. <laughs> exactly, Dr. Trifonius. We all have our own styles. And, um, it's interesting. Uh, your style changes over time. Uh, in FTD. It's, um, very much, it's very much a personal thing. Alrighty, let's pick a fight, uh, with this. Alrighty, what do we got here? And let's crank up the block count. And Wood Gunner goes over here. I'm gonna go over there. And we have caps lock activated for some silly reason. Okay, so... Alright, so I just realized a problem uh, with the Woodsider in that um, I can't just have it orbit endlessly. So, that's a problem. Also, if you drive into land, I'm going to kill you. Uh-huh. Well, we'll just see what happens, and what happens happens. I didn't put... Oh, dang it, I didn't put rubber on the front of this thing. This thing's gonna beach itself. Guaranteed. Engaging now. Oh, that's why there's lag. Also... Wait a minute. Oh, no. So there we have the little black laser. All 
Alright, let's see what the cram does. We missed. But it's okay. Oh my goodness, that caused the universe to lag. Oh lordy. How about you get the hell away from there? Moving now, moving now. Off in the distance, there's a helicopter. <laughs> firing its laser and its large missiles. This is quite a winning design if it wasn't made out of wood. I control the time. Yes, I do. And now... Yeah, using large missiles like this early in the game is a bit, um... Receiving. Moving now. It's a little bit, I guess, overpowered? How are we doing? Ah! Darn it. Darn it. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, you lot, uh, stop doing that. Whoa, that was impressive. The missiles literally just cut in t this thing in half. I wish I'd been paying close attention. I should not get too cocky uh, with this because quite frankly, um, can you aim at anything? The cram cannon is aiming. Is it reloading? Is it firing? Is it doing all the things it's supposed to do? Yep, it is. Hell yeah. And you missed. It was a stationary target and you missed. Bravo. Stone! Everybody must get stoned. I could capture these, but I don't want to. All right, we have a winning canoe set up. Oh, darn it, you're right. I don't have an amphibious canoe. I really need one. Wow, how did that not get AI deaded? Jolly good. <laughs> Your typical German, eh? Dude, how the hell do you miss a house? There's a lot of recoil, guys. Yeah, I have decided I like putting tails on canoes, in case anyone's wondering. Makes them just seem that much more canoe like. And pull all. We are successful, successful. Okay, woody goodness. Wood cider, wood gunner. We need to go up there. Lifting. Lifting. Sky Lifting canoes up. go over there. Harvest canoe, copter, you go Moving num 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 and I save the game. Because I can. Quadruple simple weapon. Uh, yes, yeah, so uh, let's go look at the... Where are you... Uh, woody goodness, wood gunner. So that is actually, it's five 30mm uh, assault cannons. So it's not that great. It's decent at shredding um, just light stuff. But um, it is hilariously fun to watch. So yeah, it's jolly good and I like it. And you can only really get away with that kind of uh, thing in mass. Uh, on lighter difficulties. What do we got over there? Scuttlegun Vanguard. Perfect! Delicious crunchy stuff. Alright, you, my friend. Um, we really do need a faster uh, trade vessel thing. We need a space canoe. Should I just make a space canoe? I think I should make a space canoe, just while I'm over here. Firstly, let's get you guys over there. Lifting. Moving out. 
you go over there. 28,000 materials. Listening. And I'm going to do the unthinkable and actually uh, build something uh, in the campaign. And I never usually do that. Okay. Everyone, welcome to how Borderwise uh, makes wooden canoes very quickly. So I just need something... Actually, what I'm going to do... is very similar uh, to how I made the... is very similar just to how I made the... what do you call it? Okay, I'm just going to stick PIDs in the front. Very simple, very simple, because I just want a fast thing that isn't the Quetzer, because as much as I love the Quetzer, where the hell did I put it? Basic PID setup. Need a fast cargo craft uh, to for all my fast cargo needs. And this is going to be wooden canoe shaped. Do 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 <gasps> Yes! It will have a tail. It will have a tail. I kind of don't want to use the drill exploit because that's... It's a little bit much. We'll have a tail, but not the one you're thinking of. Okay, ion thruster. So you are pitch, but also, but also roll. Let's see how we do. How are we doing? We've already been streaming for half an hour and it feels like no time at all. Feels like no time at all. Because I'm having so much fun. Mm -hmm. Wooden canoes are good for the soul. Wooden canoes, wooden canoes, wooden canoes. Okay. And yeah, we need more tail. level of tail. We need this level of tail. Also epic building music. Also more materials. And not so much power. Whoops. How are we doing cost-wise? This thing is super cheap. Probably need different... Yeah, let's not do that. That's a bit much. Also, one of my favorite things to do with uh, materials uh, carrying craft now is just whenever possible replace stuff with materials. Yay. Yep. Should have tail. It's got resource at tail. Like so. Alright, so this thing is quite heavy. But it's okay. Uh, do we have enough power for all this? Probably. Hmm, I'm gonna make, I'm d gonna do, no, I can't use lead on this, because that would be dumb. Uh, I'm just going to do this, huge circuit on the thruster, actually no, I'm gonna do this instead. Hmm. 
And so we do need some form of control thing, like so. Does this work? It works beautifully! Where's my control seat? There it is! And I'm gonna stick some repair tentacles uh, on this just because I can do that. Very cheap. Let's make this very pointy. Is that gonna mess with the circle of mass? No circle of mass? What? Would need more bulk. How did the well, I don't know, it's just um how did the canoe thingy start it? It just um that's just, it just was, I don't know, it kind of became a meme, I guess, in that, um, it just, I, by default, I make a lot of stuff that I just realized I don't have, okay, okay, no, 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 we need roll control, because if we don't have roll control, eh, now nah, we're fine, we have roll control, it's all good in the neighborhood. This thing is hilarious. All right, so alpha. Shiny, shiny. And this is black. Whoops. Shiny, shiny to reflect the solar radiation. Beep. And... Beep. And also... Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. This does need forward thrust, though. That is important. Can't believe I almost forgot that. And just gonna go... Very simple. And adjustment, support tank. That's all we're gonna do. In the air. Don't need to be so strong. There we go. There we go. There we go. And we're going to add one more pitch controller just up in front. Just in Kase. There we go, we have this thing. It's not quite as fast as I'd like it, but that's okay. This is the weirdest looking space canoe I've ever made. All right, how are we doing? Doing great, because they're really slow. Okay, and you, sir, are... That's not as fast as I'd like. That's a little faster. Anyway, any but, uh, nope, that's the wrong folder. Say vehicle. Okay, whoopsie daisy. Space, cargo, canoe. There we go. So if I tell you. Form up and fly to head over there, how far? What is your top speed? Yeah, that is not fast enough. So, I'm gonna do a radical thing. Super radical. Put more RTGs on this. Okay. 
more RTGs, if you please, and maximum, please. That's more like it. There we go. That's more like it now. That's the wrong folder. Why do I keep going there? Whoops, you are cargo. Keep full of energy, though. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Perfect! We have invented a thing. Hello, the bevel. Oh, yeah, I should actually... Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I am just going to put... Just very quickly... One, two, three, four. Ta-da! Just so that doesn't mess with the center of mass too much. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Okay, what was it? Where were we? Cargo goes to bigger numbers. Tilt rotors for cargo. Yeah, I, I would use tilt rotors for this, but I want this thing to fly around in space. So, that's jolly good. here stuff okay what do we got there 39,000 15,000 right you actually have a lot of money so we're gonna go over there and we're gonna build actually I'm gonna duplicate you because more laser armed helicopters is never a bad thing Duplicate. There you go. Ta-da! And we have duplication. Moving out. Lifting. Moving out. Receiving. And we're going to duplicate you because we can. There's a lot of stuff going on over there. Also, slightly epic pirate music. Receiving. Moving now. Don't you dare capture this. Darn it. Onyx, please. Please? Please do not capture that tile. I need it. Don't make me move my ships over land. I'll hate you so much. Moving out. I, th I actually have done a helicopter tutorial, uh, MSX uh, Bestia. Um, yeah, you just search uh, helicopter uh, on my YouTube channel and you will find it. Yep. I do not have a submarine canoe. Um, I should make one. It, um, it'll have to be made out of mostly lead because wood floats. Uh, space canoe cargo. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Okay then. The music's too epic. I can't handle it. Lifting. Moving out. Receiving. Well, it looks like my aircraft and um Looks like I'm gonna have to Hmm. I'm just gonna duplicate you so you can hold more stuff. You. 
Uh, Onyx Watch. The Onyx Watch likes me. Uh, we're allied. So, yeah, that's all good. Okay, we've got a whole bunch of stuff. I'm having fun. This is a fun thing. Yay. Listening. 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 Moving out. Okay, lots of stuff happening over here. Moving Sky out. canoes go over. Uh, excuse me, over there. Receiving. And. Listening. Listening. Now, what else is happening? Not much. Uh, Harvest Canoe Copter, let's go over there. How much do we have here? Did we just already... No, we didn't. Where is your... Oh, that's why. Moving out. Moving out. Mm, Pirates of the Caribbean Moving music out. is so nice. So nice, so nice. Okay. Da, 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 da. Oh yeah, driver. I always feel bad about turning on the Onyx watch. I always feel bad about it. <laughs> Hello, Natalia. Uh, da, 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 da. Recommend a certain weapon type for AA duty on a sub in 50 meter depth, or is it too much to bother to add to a sub? Missiles. Just add missiles to it. Hey there, Cypher Anonymous. Uh, Chats is behaving, yeah? Well, APS with decent... Okay, well, never mind. Never mind what I'm saying. Uh, everyone is saying APS is a good AA for subs. You do need to chuck radar buoys uh, up out of the water, though. Wow, this music is slightly too epic for what's happening on the screen right now. That is the only major problem uh, with the... Uh, with the From the Depths soundtrack. Is, um... It's just, well... The timing of the music isn't too great, because right now, it's, um... There's not anything tremendously amazing happening uh, on screen. We're just looking at the map, and yet the music's like, oh, We're storming pirate ships! Jacob's Treehouse, Vanguard, Jacob's Scorn... Sea Viper, okay. Halberd... Wow, the Deep Water Guard is getting absolutely bodied uh, by us. Also, I am going to duplicate that spider copter. Radar periscope works better than buoys, okay. Uh, Raven's Nest. I have not seen the new Raven's Nest. No. What is there to know about the new Raven's Nest? Listening. Okay, I'll have a look at it. Uh, Cypher Anonymous, I will be streaming for another hour and ten minutes. Uh, because I usually stream for about two hours. Moving out. I'm going to send a spider-copter over there to keep an eye on the Onyx Watch, because I don't trust them. Okay, and I'm going to save my game right here. Because I save scum. I'm a naughty boy. I do that. Uh, Alright, 66,000. Harvest Canoe Copter is doing its thing over there. Let's uh, pick a fight. Right here, what do we got?
Yeah, let's have a big fight. Let's have a big fight and see what happens. Hopefully we don't die horribly. Okay, what do we got? We got the Fishing Hole, Sea Viper, Vanguard, Jacob's Treehouse, Jacob's School. What is the worst that could happen? Alright. Alright, see ya, Dr. Trophonius. Alright. We're all correct, and present, and good, and let the games begin. Oh, the uh, Jacob's Treehouse has lights on it. And that is going to miss. No, it isn't. Oh my goodness. How are we doing? Doing great. Oh yeah, I forgot about this thing. Oh no, you missed. You missed, that's bad. That's not good though. Hello, the missiles are going multiple different directions. Nope, they're not. <laughs> it was a trick of the light. And Jacob's Treehouse is going to get mashed by... There we go. What did that? Yep, that cut off the treehouse. Let's see here. Oh, there's sweet maneuvers going on around here. There's sweet maneuvers. Danger close, lads. Danger close. I actually love this thing. It's not a metacraft at all, except for the fact it's got one big gun. Hey, Kestnavir, thank you for the subscription. Jolly good. Kablooey. Whee! Having a good time, having a good time, wrecking needs it with wooden canoes. And helicopters. Whee! Yay! Right. I'm the River Rat, by the way. Short showcase of all the vehicles. I want to see them all. Ah, oh, yeah, very true. I should do that. Okay, River Rat will look at you. Blah, 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 blah. Captain Sal being an insecure little wanker, as usual. Alright, so what we've got. What we've got. Alright, so we've got the Wood Cider. Uh, which is... Uh, actually, everyone turn off for a hot second. Let's just do this. No collisions, please. So... Uh, this is basically an ironclad with azipods, stuff like that. I'll show you the internals. Nothing amazing, just later. This is a cram cannon uh, with wood built around it, basically. And uh, I love this thing. It's like, it is a more extreme example of just, you know, putting a cram turret on a canoe. It's really good. Yeah, we need more tail canoes. We need more. We need more. Don't worry, we'll get more. So yeah, there's that, there's the wood gunner, which is probably the cheapest vehicle I've ever made that's actually usable. 5,000 materials, it's um, just a little uh, electric steam powered uh, little fella uh, with five mini guns on it. And uh, tail right there, and small as a pod, which I love because these things are adorable. Uh, oh yeah, so stone on the underside just for balance, and also so if they get hit below the waterline they don't sink immediately. Uh, same thing uh, over here, just a, a layer of stone on the bottom. And then we've got the canoe copters, uh, which are 
great improvisation on my part, because also electric steam, because that's cheap and compact and doesn't give off much heat. Uh, the worst laser in the universe that's good for shooting down dusters and not much else. And large missiles, long tail. Yeah, like... See, I love making things like this, even though all of the time it's not that meta to uh, do make things out of wood, because there's just something about building with wood that's, like, very freeing. Uh. Yeah, canoe copters, it's wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Okay, let's pick a fight again with these guys. Okay, canoe copter, you go right there. Canoe copter, you go right there. Woodsider, you. Wood gunner, wood gunner, wood gunner, you go there, you go there. Let's go, baby! Make sure everything is doing what it is supposed to. You have insufficient lambs for this, buddy. So long, Captain Sal. You will not be missed. Oh, yeah, so, um... In case you're wondering, yeah, these lasers do almost nothing. Almost nothing. Receiving. Uh, what are you doing? That is not... Uh-oh. 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 <gasps> Whoa, narrow miss. Very narrow miss. Receiving. Engaging now. Don't collide with each other. I would hate that. You collided with each other. I hate that. What is that? Oh, it's a Corsair. Corsairs are very annoying. And this is why my things are made of wood. Because that makes them very cheap. Also, the canoe copters are just going to win this for me anyway. Okay, never mind. Woodsider finally got a shot off. There we go. Also, fun thing about these wood gunners is that when they get damaged by anything, uh, the force tends to push them underwater where they start repairing. So that's really funny. Also, I keep being surprised by how surprisingly tough um, just layered wood is. It holds up a lot better than you... Well, it doesn't hold up particularly well Especially against things like the Corsair, which just spam little missiles, but, um, yeah. Yay! You're dead. How are we doing? We haven't actually lost anything, so let's hop over on you. I think, yeah, the balance of this thing is a little bit uh, thrown off. What are you doing? Absolutely nothing, because you're fine. I think... You didn't lose an Azipod. No, you didn't. You're just... You're just being a weirdo. You're just being a weirdo with regards to pathfinding. Do not collide with each other. I will cry. I do love how maneuverable these little wood gunners are. They're so maneuverable. They got sweet maneuvers. Whoa! Danger close, lads. Danger close. I see you and raise you. Okay, yep. 
Yep, yep, yep. Whoa. Once again, those large missiles have cut things in half. It's so great. I should make a mortar canoe. Like, when I go up against the Onyx Watch, um, I'll hopefully have a mortar canoe ready. Alright, well done, lads. Well done, lads. Let's go do that. Let's go num 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 num. And let's go over here, and I'm going to duplicate. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm going to duplicate you twice. Moving out. That's a scuttle gun. That's a gantry. Lifting. Moving out. Receiving. That's why. This is why you always stick at least one repair tentacle on everything. Yeah, maybe I should do a Cosmetia stream. That would be fun. Um, not today, though. Today is the wood canoe stream. know what I want to do. That's super fun. I want to show off the wood cider a bit. Because the wood cider is just fun. It's just a fun thing. Alright, so I'm going to drop this way down. Drop you over there. There we go. There we go. Because the scuttle gun can barely do anything. It's uh. Do I keep orientating this fella wrong? So we're humming along at a steady 30 meters per second. And the scuttle gun whiffs horribly because it's a mortar craft that is very poorly optimized. You're in control. Moving now. Moving now. Moving now. Right. Do not crash into land or you I will cry. Do not make me cry. That is very undignified. Yep. Pagoda canoe. Yeah, there's a lot of canoes to make. So, can you not do that? Actually, we're currently winning um, simply because of the uh, Moving now. bang. And I think the fight's over. Yeah, it's pretty much over. <laughs> Moving now. Yeah, early game uh, mini doom crams, I guess, like this are just really strong. Can you turn more that way? So we can have a good time, please. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing, laddie? And turn off. And we win. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. But this is, like, you know, the easiest difficulty, so I shouldn't be bragging. Brag? I should not. Shipbuilders? Yeah, what? Okay, yeah. Canoe suggestion box. Maybe I should do just do a YouTube community post and say, like, canoe suggestion box, because, my goodness, as, as it turns out, there are so many different canoes to make. Moving out. There's a steamworks, there's a gantry. Lifting. Moving out. Lifting. Moving out. Lifting. Moving out, moving out, moving out, moving out. Do 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 Num 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 Lifting Moving out Num 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 Moving out Num 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 Moving out Num 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 Duplicate you because we can Oh I love how easy these things are to build Moving out moving out Let's go excuse me I'm just gonna go Num moving out because I am too fast. <gasps> Swordfish! Epic! Lift me. 
moving. And you go right moving the out. hell here. And we you lot now, go now. and capture this. Gonna save the campaign first because I can. <gasps> yes, I should make a canoe with a tree turret on it. Oh, there's so many good ideas for canoes. Moving now. See, people say I'm the canoe guy. But honestly, it's because of the fans. It's because of the fans that I know that I can make such canoes. Hell yeah, let's party. Get back in the water, you fool! You damn fool! All oh, right. Um. Uh, one moment, please. There we go. We need some minigun action. Oh, we're right underneath it. That's not a problem. Uh oh, that might be a problem. Yikes! <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> Whoopsie poopsie. Okay, it's not a problem at all. And bullets. Never mind, we're in trouble. Never mind, we're not in trouble. <laughs> Cram cannons save everything. Is that all bombs? Oh my word, that's all bombs. Um. Oh no? Oh no? That's bad? Oh, hey, we survived. Stop dropping bombs on me. I don't like it. Woodsider needs a... I actually didn't know this thing had bombs. Ah! Receiving. You're in the Run away! Run away! Can you not? Have you heard of not? Run away! I will run away! Natalia, that is an excellent idea! Evergreen rammer! Oh -ho. When Cram Canoe is carrying the fleet, yep. And Walker Canoe. Well, wrong campaign for that, really, but, uh... Come on now. More bullets. Is the cram... Oh my word, the cram is still functional. It's been hit in the face with so many bombs. And we just won. Oh my... <laughs> the cram canoe is carrying the fleet. That's... That never happens, guys. Only on easy difficulty does that happen. Oh my word. Oh my word. Oh, this is so good. I'm having such a good time. Listening. <laughs> Moving out. Moving out. Okay, Sky Canoe. Listening. Tri-Fleet, Vanguard, Maro- <gasps> YES! The superior combat vessel! We must duel! We must duel! We must duel! Moving out. Listening. Listening. Moving out. Moving out. Come closer, Marauder. I don't know if I'm ready for a Marauder, guys, but there's only one way to find out. Also, yes, this is going to be Woodsider versus Marauder because I really want uh, this to be a duel. But first, 
Uh, let's go harass some people. Let us fry a trade fleet with helicopters. What is that thing? Oh, it's the Samoon. I like the Samoon. The Samoon's fun. To kill. Wow, we're actually dropping blocks off with the lasers. That never happens with these guys. And down she goes. Oh yes, the bevel. That's the plan. Woodsider versus Marauder. You never know, the Marauder could surprise us. The Marauder could surprise us. The Marauder is full of surprises. The Marauder is... The superior combat Moving vessel. Out. Moving out. Come closer, Marauder. Meet your fate. If you had the chance to change your fate, would you? <laughs> Okay, the Marauder's really slow, so, um... More trolling... <gasps> the Atlas! The Atlas is my other favorite thing! <laughs> Maybe I should just make a... Actually, I have been working on a suitable Doom Cram uh, to stick on a canoe. But yeah... I'm having such fun! This is how I was meant to play from the depths! I freaking love these things. Also, handy f handy fact, if you test your craft against godly designs, and then you just, you know, and then you play on easy, it's such a relief. Oh! And here we see the moment that the Atlas uh, realized that they really messed up. <laughs> I will never get tired of seeing that. Oh yeah, can, uh, Zeppelin canoe. That's a good idea. Mm, mm -hmm -hmm. Yes, oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, oh yes. Fun, fun, fun. Yeah, as you... Like, the laser does almost nothing. Almost nothing. It's good against small things that get too close, and that's about it. But it does go zap, and that makes me happy. And there goes the Atlas. Whee! I do wonder if, though if the if the missiles will be able to even lock on to the Vanguard because it's so small. I am seeing blocks uh, fly off, though. Mmm, yep. Penetrated missiles. They are the best. They are the best. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do, just for fun? I'm going to shoot the mast off. Oh, hello. Never mind. I'm not gonna bother with that. Whoop! And this is where the Vanguard realized that he really messed up. <laughs> mm. Oh, boy. Guys, there's no way I'm gonna be able to do all your canoe ideas, but I appreciate them nonetheless. Never stop. Also, I'm going to run out of space cargo canoes. Enough of this. Enough of this. The fateful battle. I must save the game. This could be the end of the campaign, folks. Because of the superior combat vessel. Time for a 
Da 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 du. Alright, so the wood gunners they go all the way back here, so there's no interference. Fateful begin. Fateful begin. That's a weird way to say it. Whoopsie daisy. Oh no, the music knows that this is epic. Ta da! Alright. Marauder fires back. The Marauder, she misses. Wee! We are Tokyo drifting like no one's business. Fire again. It is what I desire. And there go your engines. And the main gun's not in aiming. <gasps> we did it, people! We have defeated the superior combat vessel. We have done it. <laughs> I love this thing. <laughs> I really love this thing. It's so dumb, but I love it. Oh man, H-E-M-P is so good. Wow, this guy's straight up bored. He's just doing tricks now. He's coming up and out of the waves like a... Like a crazy person. <laughs> oh yeah, HEMP crams are actually really good. Uh, they're the best thing for, um, I guess, medium gauge crams. Uh, once you get really big, they get, I don't know, they're not that good. Because uh, frag out does them, but um, I guess... Uh, 1,000 to 1,500 millimeters? How could you miss? Well, that was epic. <laughs> Not gonna lie, that was actually kind of epic. Alrighty. Uh, you lot... I need to duplicate you and repair. And you need to moving out. Zip, zip, moving zip, out, zip, moving out, zip, zip, moving out, zip, 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 We totally have enough. Muns, hun, uh, to make uh, a big nasty canoe. down there and fetch some stuff come back Moving over out. here Jacob's treehouse is coming to kill us but it's okay all right see you Linux <laughs> I can't believe it's not canoe oh man I love this so much I love it okay where were we? We were doing stuff. Jacob's Treehouse coming to kill us. The moon is coming to kill us. Sky canoes are capturing stuff over here. And so we're just going to speed up time a little bit. If I could turn back time. Oh, of course, there's a flying squirrel. And this is where uh, I see if me laser actually works well or not. Uh, okay then. Interesting. I think this is bugged. I don't think it's meant to do this. Oh, 
Oh. I somehow turned time down. All right. Crappy lasers do your thing. Yeah, so they can hit it, but that's all you can really say for it. Also, it's a damn miracle if they manage to dodge the rockets it fires. Guys. Oh my word. Yay, we knocked a block off. We just barely managed it. Please dodge the missiles. Please dodge the missiles. Oh, it's not firing the missiles. Why do you not fire the missiles? What's chat saying? Yeah, I was testing all kinds of simple weapons uh, for this, and um, they didn't work so well, because the Flying Squirrel is actually kind of hard to hit. Yeah, the, oh, there we go! You gotta hit it in the ammo barrels. Okay. Listening. Moving out. Where were we? We were over here. Let's go. Let's just go destroy that. Um. Well, it is. Well, this flying squirrel is a bomber. Uh, to be fair, but I think it has. Um. It has unguided rockets on it. So. And they can occasionally hit aircraft. So. Um, you, nah, well, particle cannons tend to be lousy at long range, unless you make them pretty big, so... Uh, this was, like, you know, out of everything I tested, this was the... I'm not gonna say the best option, I'm gonna say the least bad option. Because it does the job. Uh, they can kill a flying squirrel, it's just, it's an emergency thing. These guys... Um... <laughs> you gotta ram it up its bum. But yeah, it's, um... That is an emergency laser. It's not, um, it's not by no means is it the main job of this craft. Once again, we cut things in half. And we're unscathed. Perfecto. Listening. Receiving. And, you know what Listening. we should do? We're gonna clone you and clone you. I'm just filling up the entire freaking world uh, with resource harvesting helicopters. I actually haven't uh, shown off with these guys, have I? We split, and we split. Lifting. Moving out. Moving out. Lifting. Lifting. Moving out. Lifting. Lifting. Moving out. Any butt. Lifting. This is what this guy looks like. Stay in the freaking resource zone. There we go. So, bit of an interesting design. Um, mostly because of all the lead in the front to keep the center of mass where I want it to be. Do not drift out of the resource zone, I swear to gee. I swear to gee, you, you're gonna do it. You're gonna do it. Yeah, it's very flat. There's no real point to having this thing be wider, because this thing's never gonna see combat. And... You go back there. And pull. And save the game. Because that is what I desire. And... Um, pew! Uh, what is that? Jacob's Treehouse is running away. Right you are. Moving out. And you go capture out. there, because we can do that, and I'm going to leave that as a little buffer. And you know what I might do is, I might, um, if we kill the Deepwater Guard during the stream, uh, I might stop it there and then put smoke on the thing I'm planning to build Lifting. over here. Where is my space canoe stuff? Lifting. You gotta get back to where I want you to be. Get back, get back, get back to where you once belong. I could actually do that, uh, Natalia, making a one-block tall heli, because 
yeah, that wouldn't even be that difficult, I don't think. Because uh, you can just make it, like, so flat. Yep. Alright, so now we can make a big canoe. Lifting. It is time for big Lifting. canoe. Big canoe! So, quad cannon. Four barrels of 500 millimeter potty mix. Ready to go. Quad cannon and fleet name is Woody Goodness 2. No. One. Perfect. 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 Alrighty, how about you? Receiving. Nah, you're gonna go over there. And I do want my uh, copters actually to uh, be down here. So you guys, you go over there. Actually, while you're over there, yeah. Yep, yeah, uh, we're we're just gonna kill ya. Excuse me. Thank you. Moving now. Perfect. All right. <laughs> well, the fact that this is on quite an easy difficulty does uh, help. It helps a lot, as a matter of fact. Receiving. It is night time. Night time is fright time. And Kablooey... Wait a minute. Wow, it's, it literally went through there, threaded the freaking needle. How are we doing? We're doing okay, don't worry about it. Don't even worry about it. Also, handy fact about um, sticking a tail on these guys. Because this is such a cluster of blocks, uh, I tend to find that a lot of weapons tend to aim for that, which is actually really convenient. Alright, don't thread the needle. You didn't thread the needle. You, in fact, ripped this thing in a new butthole. Perfect! That's what we want to see. <laughs> big iron versus big wood. Don't drive into land. I will kill you. Fire that cram. Fire that cram. And AI dead. This is why HE uh, EMP crams are so good, uh, particularly in the early game. It's because they do that. They blow the hell out of things and just fry their electronics. And the Deepwater Guard craft actually don't have good EMP protection, so it works really well. I have not looked inside the treehouse. And I would right now, but the insides are gone. Also, great thing about using wooden craft is that, um, well, the repair bell is non-existent. It's fantastic. Lifting. Oh, oh, we gotta... We gotta... Lifting. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. You harvest in a what? Moving out. You're not harvesting. How about you harvest? Moving out. Lifting. Moving out. There we go. Let the harvesting commence. All right, so you, my friend, get down over there, and I'll show you guys what this fella can do. Out. And this out. guy, I can get to do a Cantabrian circle. So, play this guy. This is a much bigger boy. <laughs> so yeah, this is a similar canoe design to the others, just lots of azipods. 
And uh, yeah, big freaking gun. Also, uh, last minute edition, it's got this little AA laser just on the back. Munition warners on the tail. And more munition warners on the front. And yeah, like, I like this thing. This is about as meta as canoes can get because it's a monitor. And it's got four different kinds of ammo. It's got, uh, let me show you the ammo this thing fires. All 500 millimeter, uh, two meter, was it two meter or four meter shells? It was four meter shells. So uh, we've got, um, we've got squash EMP. Uh, we've got fra heat frag. Uh, we've got timed fuse uh, flak frag. And we've got HE uh, flak smoke. And the, the only reason this is a smoke warhead is so that this thing can actually do damage against the Alcazar, because I hate the Alcazar, and knowing our luck, we might very well run into one. So yeah, that's the quad cannon, and yeah, it's got just basic missile interceptors for defense as well. Yeah, so it's a, it's a big, it's a big, beautiful thing, and I love it. And we're about to blow the crap out of, um, well, everything, really. Well, interesting, these things have shadows. How about you don't do that? Have you heard of don't? Also, I just realized that I need to reclass this thing as a ship. Because I forgot to do that. Listening. Engaging now. Water mode at your service. And ta-da! Alright, lads. Oh yeah, by the way, this thing has a lot of uh, little missile interceptors. So yeah, this is why wooden uh, monitor canoes are actually pretty efficient, because, um... Uh, aim for this thing, please. Now. There we go! <laughs> oh yeah, I didn't realize that the map was 3D. That's interesting. The, the problem with this guy is that uh, runs on steam, does burn through materials quite quickly, but also murders things really fast. Also, fun fact, this thing starts to staggered fire after a while. I love this thing. It's got a pancake on it. <laughs> Explosions. Ooh, cool. Oh, that was a big explosion. I liked it. Yep, AI dead, there we go. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Alright, uh, you, my friend, can go off and destroy stuff. Lifting. Moving out. Receiving. You go there. Lifting. Moving out. Moving out. Nom 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 um, uh, this is a good thing. <laughs> Alright, how do you enable free cam? Hmm. Do 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 do. Okay, what else? I want to look at my canoe folder. What have I not loaded? Oh, I have a cram bomber. I should probably build that. And there's, yeah, variants from the wood gunner, but eh, that's okay, space gunner, yeah. 
So I have a cram bomber. It's a uh, it's not very good because I don't think I've ever made a good cram bomber in my life. But um listening. Moving out. Receiving. Moving now. Listening. Moving out. Moving out. Moving out. Hmm. Alrighty, tidy. You go over there. Lifting. Lifting. Interesting. These guys don't actually have enough uh, energy generation to keep up with their resource. So I'm just gonna quickly, quickly chuck an extra RTG on them. gonna make them a wee bit more expensive but it's gonna be worth it so save vehicle harvest canoe copter pull all and brace yourselves dumpty 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 do There we go, that's better by the looks of it. There we go, they're keeping up. Perfect! Alright, oh! Lightning from a cloudless sky. Never mind, it's not cloudless. There we go. Thunder, feel the thunder. Lightning and the thunder. Damn! You ever stop and think that From the Depths is actually kind of a gorgeous game? Like, the water effects aren't anything to write- where the hell am I? Where is the camera right now? Hmm. This is actually quite a- it's like, you know, for a indie game, for a something made with Unity, Pretty darn good. Also, when you tell the game to accelerate, that makes it interesting. Okay, Sky Canoes, Fishing Village. You know what? I'm gonna let the Onyx Watch take care of that. I'm gonna focus down here, because we're allies. We're buddies! Yep. Yeah, it's like... Actually, there are graphical mods uh, for From the Depths, uh, I believe. Let's head down over here where it's warmer. Oh, that's weird. Eye of the Storm right there. Damn, that looks pretty. Where did Nixmart find these clouds? Because they good clouds. Alright, let's, uh, let's uh, load in the cram bomber I made because... It's fun. It's not... It's not great, but it's okay. It's a fun thing. And then we can... What can we go bomb? Oh, hello. What's that? Swordfish. Actually, I could send that up there. Just to go... Uh, Hello, uh, you swordfish, you really picked the wrong thing to mess with. Like, you really picked the wrong thing to mess with. Like, really, really picked the wrong thing to mess with. This thing can solo a crossbones. And here you are trying to be Mr. Cool Man. Technically, we keep missing. Also, technically, you're dead. <laughs> T 
Ta-da! I need to put rubber on the azipod. Oh, so flat. It's such a flat thing. It is the flattest of things. Ta-da! Ta-da, da 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 Receiving. Moving now. Righty ho then. Righty ho then. Let's go bomb some stuff. Moving out. Moving out. Lifting. Moving out. Lifting. And fleet name. Cram Bomber Squad 1. Grum, 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 grum. I say game. Also, pirate music is great. Mmm, pirate music. Mmm, yes. Mm, 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 mm. Oh yeah, the water on the map is... I wouldn't... I wouldn't say real. That would be very bad for my computer if it was real water. Okay, so yeah, these guys are doing that. I do wonder... This is a lousy first test uh, for a bomber. Uh, but, um... I just want to see if this works. <laughs> Think, what is the altitude? So this is our cram bomber. Fun thing with this, it's all azipod controlled, so... Are these things on the side? Roll azipods? Pitch as a pod, steering as a pod. And here is the giant ass cram cannon, and I forget what's in it. You missed! But that's okay, because you're coming around for another go. <laughs> also, yeah, technically it's a gunship. Technically, it is a gunship, because it's got a gun on it. But that's okay. Yeah, this is not a good matchup because the Samoon is actually very bouncy. But we only really need to get lucky once. It's a winning aircraft design, if nothing else. Uh, but yeah, cram bombers are always a little bit iffy. And also, if the angle's not right, that's really annoying. Because we're going to get an endless circling problem. Might have to bring in the helicopters for this. Or not. Never mind. <laughs> now I remember it is, um... It is, uh... It's got HEMP on it, because once again, that's really useful. Yeah, so not a tremendously powerful cram cannon. Um, well, it's got it's big, but it's only three layers deep, so kind of missing out a bit. Did I really? Was I? No. Okay, thank goodness. Yeah, it's a big thing. It is a big thing. But yeah, all right, time to go adventure some more. I could go bomb that fishing village. I'm tempted to do, actually. No, it's got a Falkenheim. We need good AA. Or at least decent AA. Big Woody goodness, you go down, capture that. Woody goodness, you go over there. Spider Copter, you go over there. Where? Space Canoe Cargo, you go grab that. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. 
Stretchy, stretch. Stretchy, 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 stretchy. Lifting. Moving out. Lifting. Ooh, paddle gun. I know I can kill a paddle gun. Let's, uh, let's put the cram canoe bomber really through its paces and see if it can blow up a paddle gun. It should be able to. Moving out. Should be able to. Especially if we start right on top of it. Hopefully this doesn't go very south. Yep, AI did immediately. <laughs> yes. I will crack open my emergency caffeine. Hydration time. You're absolutely right, people. Thank you for looking out for my health and sanity. Da like, moving out. This is the second attempt uh, at a wooden cram bomber I've had, actually. Actually, no, you Moving will come down here and you will provide air support. Lifting. Moving out. Moving out. Aw, oh, come on, guys. Come on, guys, don't be like that, baby. Alrighty, time to. Uh, what was that about war crimes? Yeah, I'm about to do that. Hydrate as a channel point reward. Define hydrate? Uh, do, do. What do we got here? We got a lot of stuff. Uh, we got a conger. Oh, we got a godly craft. Interesting. Uh, da, 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 da. Sword fish, lots of stuff. Receiving. Moving now. I really do hope that I've uh, optimized this thing very well. We're gonna minimize this. Let's drop this down to 40k, and I do want the quad cannon to spawn in first. Cram canoe bomber will make its approach out here. And away we go! That looks like a pretty battle-ready conger to me. Alright, fella. Uh-oh. I hope I haven't bitten off more than I can chew. Probably not. That's a lot of airships. That actually just bounced off the deck, I don't believe it. And down goes the conger, by the looks of it. Did that do it? Hmm, this is slightly more epic than I thought it would be. Also, that little laser is perfect for taking down these little crappy dusters. Perfect, I say. Damn. Did I accidentally just make a really formidable canoe? Well, I, I mean... Wow. Also, I think, uh, Hesh EMP 
is one of my favorite shell types. It's so goofy, but it actually works really well. And you're disabled. Also, I cannot believe I nev it never occurred to me to mount uh, little tail-mounted lasers on canoes before. Because that's actually really handy. I love this little laser. See? Experimenting is fantastic. Is fan dabby dozy, in fact. Canoe bomber? There we go. And the bomber is here. And the bombing run did something. Oh, it just took out the floor. actually made a decent cram bomber. Did I accidentally do that? Look how flat this thing is. I am the flat master. Also, I like how if you just build with wood, you can have very big scary things like very quickly. AI dead? Nope. Yep, yep, yep. I guess that's why I remember in one of uh, Lathrix, Lath, Lathrix's uh, neater playthroughs, he was experimenting with just like a whole bunch of wooden starting craft and they actually turned out to be really strong, simply because they were glass cannons and they had so much firepower. Um, it makes best here. Um, I... People keep telling me that bomb shoots are really good. I have never ever seen uh, bomb shoots being used effectively. It's just every time uh, I've made effective cram bombers, they've always just used motorized barrels and, and standard barrels. So yeah, I don't use bomb shoots because I personally don't think they're very good. Alrighty ho then. We've got about ten minutes left. Let's uh let's fry this up here. And we can actually get our cram bomb squad up there as well because I actually kinda like seeing it work. Oh hello. Uh lightning hoods. We have Red Contact! Whoopsie Daisy, alright. Uh I'm going to make a second excuse me, there we go. Duplicate split off. That you are repairing, and that is good. Moving I'm gonna go over there, look at stuff. Epic pirate music. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do, 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 do. Conduit, current, all this groovy stuff here. Oh, we might as well just straight up finish uh, the, uh, hello, what's that? That's a Marauder. <gasps> Can the big woody goodness? Moving out. Can it handle a Marauder, do you Moving think? Receiving. Probably can handle a Marauder. Alright, woody goodness, you come over here. And gonna wipe this out. And then, we will have a good time. Let's go, baby. Let's go. We're 
gonna come in from over there. You're gonna come in from over there. You're gonna come in from over there. You know you're gonna come in from over there, and away we go. Chat is chatting. That is wonderful. Wait a minute. Oh. No way. Is this bomber gonna be able to... Nope, it isn't, but... And... Bang. Yeah. She is going down. Also very handy for the 156 meters per second thing to draw fire. And there goes the windmill. <laughs> doop, 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 doop. Uh, resource, um, Cypher Anonymous. Cypher Anonymous, um, I run a, uh, my YouTube channel is, uh, chock full of From the Depths tutorials, so... Yeah, like, um, I'd start there, but who else? Um, Omis Futile, who I've shouted out on the channel multiple times. Also, um, does good tutorials. Who else, who else? Um, there's smaller channels as well. Uh, Trekker Joe is one. Um, not sure if they're still making From the Depth stuff. Haven't seen them in a while. But yeah, they're good. Um, a lot... There's a, there's some really good old YouTube channels out there, but a lot of them... You know, a lot of the tutorials are outdated, so... Ireland Gaming, Rosefall... Uh, stuff like... Um, channels like that... Great stuff, and still worth watching, in my opinion, but, um... Yeah, the game's moved on since they were making content. Okay, Cypher Anonymous. Like, I wasn't sure, like... It was a moment of, like, um... Do, do they... Do they... Do they know? <laughs> do they know that tutorials are a major thing I do? <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, apparently my tutorials are not enough. We bang, bang, bang. War crimes, war crimes, war crimes are fun. War crimes, war crimes, up the bum. Right, the lasers are having trouble hitting these darn things. Man, I love my helicopters. <laughs> Oof. Flooding, hey. It's okay, Cypher Anonymous, I get it. I get it. It's just, I don't know. It was like, I don't know. It, uh, that, yeah, you're, it could have been taken out of context, but I understand what you were saying. Just are there any are there any like YouTube channels besides mine that do stuff? So yeah, almost futile would be my top recommendation. Mostly because like what the hell did he do? He did a breadboard tutorial actually, which I have yet to do because uh, I am a clumsy baker at best. Yep, yep. Yeah, time flack is really good. It's really good and amazing. Let's uh, speed this up a little bit, shall we? We. Aimbot player, aimbot laser. Come on now. We could just do this. This is relaxing. 
Come on. Into the ground with ye. Ta-da! Um, yeah, Dust Boot, you just need to have a timed fuse on your shell and then have a laser targeter, and that's it. And the timing on the shell doesn't really matter, so I just use it, uh, I just usually put it to maximum. A uh, Big Cheese APS shell. Uh, hollow point railguns are still very much up there, but I believe, uh, pen depth, um, pen depth railguns, I th I believe, are, uh, stronger. And I know that because I remember... Uh, not complaining, but commenting on just how strong and uncounterable Hollowpoint Railguns were. And, um... Yeah, people responded with, like, Dude, that's what you're worried about? Like... <laughs> oh, I forgot the cram bomber was here! <laughs> that scared me. Um... But yeah, I'd say, um... Just any form of kinetic railgun is where the... You know... The super meta is at. Time versus altitude fuses, pros and cons. I have literally never, ever used altitude fuses. Simply because vehicles um, change altitude too often. And, like, you know, they vary in what altitude they fly at too much. So, I've literally never used them. Like, I think I have tried them and, yeah, they are as disappointing as you might expect. So, yeah, I'm not, not a fan. Not a fan of them. I've never really used altitude fuses with crams either, except occasionally with cram bombs, uh, when I want them to explode on the waterline. Or with cram mortars, that can sometimes be pretty good. I forgot this thing has swing wings. It flies like a very annoying swallow. I should probably stick AA guns uh, on this cram bomber. I think I have uh, the ammo capacity for it. Can you hurry up and stop being annoying? No one likes you, little duster. No one likes you. No one likes you. You need to stop now. You need to hurry up and die so we can get on with our lives. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hurry up and die. Yes, spiral into the ground. Spiral into the ground, you wee bastard. No, you're doing it wrong. You're spiraling into the air. That's not what we want. We want you to not stop resisting the siren call of gravity. There we go. There we go. Um, I wonder if a cram bomb is going to come out of nowhere and flatten you. Let's see what happens. Hmm... Humpty Dumpty Doo. Hello, hello. Look at our big friend here. I wonder if he's dropping presents. Oh, he is. <laughs> oh, hello. Ooh, yes, I do want to. Moving out. <gasps> oh, that's exactly what I wanted to do anyway. And... Bang? Not yet. We need more bang. So yeah, I think I'm gonna flatten this and then, uh... Well, what do you say, folks? Should we finish off the Deep Water Guard since we're here? Oh boy. Current events. Oh no! Oh shakes, driver, that's terrible. Died in a flood? Which state are you in, uh, driver? Norin West Farin? I don't know where that is. Oh yeah, sorry, I for driver, I forgot you were from Germany. <laughs> okay, that's that's scary. Over 100 people dead in a flood. Jeez. Wait, it's summer up in Germany. Yeah, that's that is a scary thing. Jeez. Why is the game 
continuing to tell me about, you know, can you stop, please? I know the deep water guard hates me. You don't need to keep telling me. I think it's because we jumped immediately into another battle. Jeez. Man, that's a downer. Current events are always such a downer. Unless it's good news. Oh my w buddy, dude. Wow, you've made- the cram bomb is sad now, that's why it keeps missing. Yeah, does F1 fix it? Nope, it doesn't. Wow. My canoes are too epic, they broke the game. What the hell? Um, the Onyx watch appar- Why did- what? Okay, the Onyx watch just declared war on me. Alright, um... That is what we in the business call a problem. Because of- did we trespass? We can't have. Why did that happen? Why did- Oh, we're skirmishing now, apparently. Did one of my craft drift into Onyx Watch territory by mistake? Great, well, thank you, very pleased. Well, we were gonna kill them eventually. Yeah, I'll, I wanna check the map, but, well, you know... Man... Man, that's no fun. Come on. More cram bummage, please. Oh boy. Oh boy. That's not good. I'm gonna have to wipe out the Deepwater Guard, like, post-haste. Can you please, like... I think we're having trouble pathfinding here. We are having trouble pathfinding. Okay, you, my friend, Listening. Control moving out. get some distance, then come back in a straight line. Hopefully that fixes it. Yep, well, who was it who said that the Onyx Watch, like, can stab you in the back? Because I think... That's exactly what happened. Not okay with that. Alright. Land a cram bomb right on this thing's damn AI, please. There we go. Kablooey. Alright, let's see here. Who wandered where? Why the hell? What? There's no way that should have happened. Oh, you... It's because they captured that tile? I didn't realize. I did not realize Moving. at all. Okay, then. That's my fault. I should have been more observant. Bugger. <laughs> like, there's still deep water guard stuff on there. Oh, well. Um... Well, the cram... Alright, this cram bomber has now got a new job. It's going to patrol the frontier. And over here, you, my friend, uh, are going to uh, quickly build a spider copter. Uh, right here. Where's my spider copter? Aircraft, spy sets, spider copter. Go there, pull all. Lifting. Okay, oh boy, there's a cauldron. There is a cauldron! Lifting. Right, sky canoes, defending the land. All right, and the and the white flyers are suspicious of us. That's great. Lifting. All right, you gotta Moving go over out. there. Moving out. Thankfully, most of the Onyx Watch stuff is really slow, so. Lifting. Moving out. Lifting. Right, you're Moving over out. there, manning that, and we're gonna go. Alright, so this is a ship's only run. There's a lot of stuff here. What is that? That's a prowler. David Jones outpost. Paddle gun. Fish in a barrel. 
Okay then, uh, boy. How about you? Oh wow, a lot of stuff has happened. I'm gonna save the campaign here. Wood. New. Conquest. Three. Save. And hopefully, uh, the Onyx Watch comes and kills us over there. Okay, there's cool stuff happening. Listening. Moving out. Moving out. Alright, cool stuff happening, cool stuff happening, Listening. cool stuff happening. Moving out. Right, there's the Marauder. Receiving. Hmm, I wonder. Quad Cannon versus Paddle Gun. Alright, alright. See you, Kestavir. Alright, so this is two glass cannons going head to head. Uh, my money's on my one because it's big and it's got bigger guns. Also, it's really fast. Although the shields on this thing are really annoying. Or you could just EMP the weapons on it. How are we doing? Just scratches here, there, and everywhere. There we go. Also, wow, fun fact, the paddle gunner uh, almost costs the same uh, as our big canoe friend here. Oh, sorry, Kestavir, sorry. Um, for some, I saw a TY, thank you, and thought it was saying TG, good night, so yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, how did I get a quad thing? Well, it's big, so... Uh, this is a big gun, so... And uh, it's also necklace, so... It's got this lovely undergrowth of coolers right here. Four meter loaders. Extra coolers up on top. And uh, yeah, it's not a very durable turret because, well... Uh, if you shrink the blocks, there's two meters of wood uh, in between this and the scary outside world. So it's just very compact, it's very square. No, don't, no, don't leave, Kestavir. Don't, don't kick out Kestavir, does boot. All right. If you have no time for this, we must kill the Marauder. Ah! We must kill the Marauder, and then we must kill the Deep Water God. We must do it. We must do it now. We must do that thing. <laughs> Bum. Bum. Wow, right in the ammo compartment. Also, we just knocked the main gun out again. I have got to play with uh, H E E M P. Wow, AI dead immediately. Damn. Num 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 num. Alrighty. Receiving. Groovy, baby. Listening. Listening. Moving out. Listening. Alright, Harvest Moving Helicopter, out. you go there. Duplicate. There we go, there we go, there we go. Listening. Listening. 
Okay, save game. Saving the game is important. Listening. Moving out. Actually, you. I'm going to duplicate you. Listening. Faster, please. Moving out. Run. Moving out. Just if you have a whole mob of space canoe cargo vessels, it's just they carry a lot of stuff. Okay. Alrighty. Big Woody goodness. Woody goodness. We're gonna take on the HQ. We're gonna take on the HQ. Moving out. Uh, of this. Yep. Alrighty, let's wipe out the Deepwater God so we can focus on the Onyx Watch. That'll be very nice. It'll be very nice. It'll be very nice. Alright, so we can't have too much stuff in here, otherwise, this will take millions of years. So we're gonna park you over there. We're gonna park you. Excuse me, I'm very burpy. Ready and let's begin. This is exciting. And the prowler is, uh, let's see here. We're actually taking a, uh, a fair bit of damage right now. Thankfully. Oh, I forgot about the freaking paddle gunner. Yeah, you gotta kill the paddle gunner. Yeah, because that thing is really annoying. I hate the paddle gun, it's so irritating. Yeah, we are losing blocks really fast. <laughs> Getting as lucky with fighting this battle gunner. <laughs> this is actually got a chance. Yes. Damn it, I was playing on this difficulty so I don't have to deal with godlies. Deacon's Christmas. But is the gun alive is the question. Oh, thank you for freaking everything. Okay. I can breathe a little bit. Also, reasonably speedy repairs on our quad cannon here, so... Big turret, good turret. Actually, to be perfectly honest, who? <laughs> yes, canoe supremacy. Bow down to the might of canoes. Back the other way, please. Gonna need you to turn around, babe. Thank you. Thank goodness for azipods. How are we doing? We're doing great. We're doing great. 
I really need to check the news or something just to see what the hell's happening over in Germany. It's floods, eh? Isn't it summer uh, up there in Germany? Like, at what time do you get heavy rains? Jeez. Yeah, living next to the Rhine, eh? Hmm. Woof. Yeah, it's easy. Like, I don't want to say climate change, but I just did. Because, uh, yeah, we've been having weird weather down here in New Zealand as well. Uh, it's winter down here, and it's like, it's cold, but it's also dry, which is not good. So, um, and the last summer was really, really hot, so, yeah, we were facing a water shortage over here, so it's like, yeah, yeah, things are not good, the weather's acting up. Okay. Forgot how giant the freaking David Jones outfit was. We're going to need some backup. Also, we're going to need to z zap this off. There we go. Oh, this is a diff gun and I love it. I'm gonna kill it. Yes! Reinforcements! Don't collide with each other, please. You're looking a little bit holy there, my friend. My friend. Okay. Yeah, well, yeah, the world's kind of doomed. Yeah, that's, I've been hearing that, like, in the United States and Canada, there's, like, serious heat waves. That's no good. Yeah, we're, we are in deep trouble. Also, good news, the David Jones outpost is dead. Because we just won the game. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Wooden canoes pulling their worth, although it is scary watching your canoe get minced. But that's why wood spam can work. You can lose a lot of health and then be fine. Oh boy, but man. Man, the world's in trouble, guys. Doesn't always feel like it, but then you read the news and you realize, uh-oh. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Just, uh, yep, in less than three hours we've beaten the Deepwater Guard. Let's have you disintegrate a little bit faster. Because, fun fact, I actually have to go help uh, people move. So, uh, I need to, <laughs> I need to, I need, actually need to get going. Yes, the bubble reject metal return to wood spam. Yeah. Yeah, you know what's you know what's scary about um, summer floods in Germany is that that's tropical weather. So uh, the problems that tropical countries face, um, you're going to be seeing a lot more of that, and unfortunately, that includes things like malaria. You and me uh, both, Cipher. The news is just it's just too much. It's just too much stuff happening all at once, all over the place, and a lot of it. Is bad. The good news is that we destroyed Nita's pirates, so uh, next we gotta go murder the Onyx Watch, so so yeah. Pull all, thank you. Are the Onyx Watch coming to kill us yet? Um, nope. Thank goodness. But yeah, that'll do for this stream. Uh, I'm having fun, so I guess, well... What? Oh. Well then, I achieved peace with the Onyx Watch by destroying the Deepwater Guard, but I've gone and parked my forces in their territory already anyway, so that's dumb. That's dumb. 
So, yeah, that's it for the stream. That's it for the stream. And I guess I will see you next time. Uh, for more streamy goodness with wooden canoes. And I have a lot of wooden canoes to build. Because there were so many good wooden canoe suggestions this stream. So, thank you. Oh, no. Not more news about the weather. Oh, boy. So, yeah, thank you all so much for watching and following and subscribing and stuff that. Yeah, see you next week. And, yep, I have a YouTube channel. I believe I mentioned that. Like, if you don't know about it, I assume most of you do. So, yeah, go check that out. There's lots of good stuff. And, yeah, I will see you um, next time, next week, same time, same place. Same from the depths canoe-filled goodness. So, farewell. Bye. Have a good one. I hope the weather improves. See ya. Take care.